विद मी इज रॉबिन डिसूजा वी जस्ट पास बाय अ म्यूजिक शॉप इन पैंजम एंड रॉबिन हैज अ स्टोरी टू टेल और यू नॉट श्योर वेदर ही रिमेंबर्स इट ऑल टेल I don't think no. My grandfather had something to do with this gentleman, Pedro yeah. Fernandez. Yeah, Pedro Fernandez. And he either trained him or showed him how to tune guitars and that. And then I don't know what the story goes. Your grandfather was Gordon. Gordon. Full Gordon. name. Full name. Cillian Gordon. Sorry. Cillian. Cilliano. Sorry. C i l i a n o. एंड Yeah, and and from Quetta he learned the trade. He was working in in one of the uh, okay. music store. Okay, he learned everything, etc., etc. And uh, when the earthquake came, yeah, he came as a refugee back to India. Which part of India? Delhi. Delhi. Yeah. And he opened a series of music shops. How many series? Meaning how many? Maybe four, five. Four, five. Bombay, Delhi. So he Blood. came back in which year? Simla. In which year he came back? I, I don't remember that. Twenty thirties, twenty thirties, tens. I have to. Your dad was how old at that time? Mother, 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 mother. Mother was a school girl or what? No. She uh, at the time of the earthquake, she was the eldest in the family. And she was how old? I must be in twenties or twenties. Twenties. Yeah. So he was already an established guy in the field of music shops. No. So after the earthquake, he came and he started off. Okay. What Before the earthquake, he was not running his own shop. He was. I don't think so. No. So then, uh, Robin, he he carried on for how long and at what point did he give up the shops? He didn't give up. He passed it on to his son. Who is who is running it now? Somebody else. They all of them have sold out. Okay. So the name continues. Gordon continues, but yeah. it's not your family. Delhi. I don't even think the name continues. What is the name in Delhi now? I, if they've opened some blood testing place or you know something. Okay. I know there's a massive yeah. affair. He had. I don't know exactly. It was a large shop. One hundred pianos. Really? Yeah. The massive thing. Now this is before independence. What? Before independence, I guess. Supplying. Actually, I'm, actually, I'm not much of a history person. Yeah. Uh, Neither so. am I. It's okay. But Robin, what I'm saying is that Goan somehow had a monopoly over music shops in many parts of uh, Asia, South Asia, East Asia, Africa. No. Yeah, but he was always in India, and in Bombay they had that strand, that strand. Uh, strand. Theatre. Yeah. We had the shop over there. Okay. So, so, so uh, the ancestral village you said was San Stevao. Yeah. He knew music. He knew music. He was a piano tuner and everything. I think so. Yeah. Very interesting. If you find out more, please let us know. And if someone wants to contact you with more on the Gordon story, what's your number for now? <laughs> Nine zero four nine nine zero four nine two four nine two four nine six zero nine six zero nine. Thanks, thanks so much. Lovely.